Hello you guys. Today I am going to get my hair done. I am ready pretty early though. It's only 1047 and my appointment's at 1, but I do need to leave here at like 1130ish. It's going to probably take me an hour to get there and I want to be a little bit early so I'm not late just in case of traffic or anything. So before I go to my hair appointment, I did want to talk to you guys about some exciting news that I got yesterday. I got a new job. I'm really excited about it. I have a lot of emotions going through my mind, but the main one is excitement. I had an interview about a week ago. It went really well. And yesterday I went back in and talked to the owner and we kind of discussed like what I wanted, what the job would entail, and I got the job. Um, I'm also very anxious because I do have to leave my current job and I love where I work right now. I currently have this family and a ton of friends where I work. I love it there. I'm gonna miss them a lot. The change is gonna be different. And I had a little bit of a mental breakdown last night, just kind of thinking about all the change. Am I making the right decision? Of course I'm making the right decision. This is gonna be a job I'm gonna have in my field. And I think I just needed to process everything because yesterday I was just like, my feelings and emotions were all over the place. I was in shock, but obviously there's gonna be a lot of learning and training that I need to do and room for improvement. And I'm just really excited for that. Finally changed, I got head out the door, white t-shirt and just some denim jeans and my Converse. I don't even think you can see my Converse. So this is my hair before. She's done it many times. It's really pretty. She does like lived in hair. So basically like, when your hair grows out, it still looks really nice. I just pulled up right now. This place is seriously so cute. It's called the Powder Room in Mission Viejo. All right, guys, this is Sarah. This is Hello. my hair girly. She's amazing. She went to go mix up some color. My hair is looking crazy, but we're gonna get this going and I can't wait to see what it looks like at the end. I'm so ready to get rid of all this. My hair, it looks amazing. She always does an amazing job. I'm obsessed. What do you think of my hair? It looks good. You look you look older, I don't know. <laughs> what the heck is in my hair? I'm not even gonna act like it's the same day. It's two days later. If you wanna know what I did yesterday, I vlogged for two seconds. I went and test drove cars with my mom. I did not buy a car, but I wanna buy a car. But I'm gonna wait for my paycheck for when I get my new job to really feel comfortable paying for a new car. I wanted to share with you guys my skincare routine because for Christmas, I mentioned I got a lot of new skincare products and I want your guys' opinion if you're an esthetician or if you just know like what's good for your skin. Is what I'm using actually good for my skin? I'm new to the skincare world. So I just wanted to share with you guys, new year, new skincare, new hair, new job. This is, I'm really turning into a doll, guys. I actually really need to put my hair up and hold on. Look how cute my little ponytail is so little first things first my cellar cleansing water this stuff really does take off my waterproof makeup like no tomorrow Ooh, i just built it i really like using a cleansing balm this is the elf one i know there's better ones out there so i double cleanse i heard double cleansing is really good to get all your makeup off the cleanser i use is the tatcha the rice wash cleanser i actually really like it it's really good on the skin For toner, I've been using the Glow Recipe Water Glow PHA and BHA Pore Tight Toner. I've heard good things about this. I've heard better things about the Paula's Choice ones. So let me know your opinions down below. Does this stuff actually do anything or is it just like really good smelling and like really aesthetic? For serums, I got this Bioma, I think that's how you pronounce it. The hydrating serum, it came in like a little trio of the moisturizer and the cleanser in this. I do have this prescription Retin-A that I got from my doctor. I use it every like three to four days just because it dries out your skin, but this stuff is a lifesaver. I'm not even gonna pretend like I know what this is. It's an oil and it has retinol in it. Not Retin-A, but retinol. So this is supposed to be really good for your skin as well. My eyes are seriously so dry all the time, like right here in the corners and then my dark spots. So I've been using the CeraVe Eye Repair Cream. I don't know if it's doing anything, but I just like to have a little bit of moisturizer on my eyes. 
And last but not least, I don't use this every day, but this is the Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. And this has been hyped up forever and I get it now. This stuff makes my face look so smooth. I swear it looks like I'm putting like a blur effect on, but it's just so nice. So it's the next night. Today I did see some of my family. We kind of did like a redo of Christmas because on Christmas night my mom got COVID and I was supposed to see my family the next day. So just in case I had COVID, I didn't want to expose anybody so I didn't go see them. But I got to see them today finally almost a month later. I got a nightstand as one of my gifts from my Thea and Theo and I wanted to show you guys what I'm doing. This is what it's supposed to look like. It's the natural wood color one right here. This is my current nightstand situation. So I'm gonna watch some Love Island and I'm gonna do a quick time lapse and see how long this fucking takes me. stand is seriously so cute next to my bed and the drawer is pretty deep as well i have all my hair clips in there and my vitamins it's just so cute so i literally ended the night by cleaning my whole room i vacuumed i put all my christmas stuff away that i've had laying out because i've been just so lazy and i'm gonna end this vlog here now i hope you guys enjoyed this little like few days in my life i guess i hope you guys enjoyed i'm really entering my adult era i have my new job and everything and hopefully i can share more with you guys about all of that fun stuff see you guys next time bye guys mm -hmm.